we're not only going to ban the drugs, we're not only going to stop giving out taxpayer-funded drugs, we are going to provide treatment and recovery. If, if you were out there, if you were watching today and you're suffering from addiction and you don't know how you can turn your life around, I want you to know that there is hope. There is a better future ahead. We will put the money into beautiful treatment centers with counseling, group therapy, physical exercise, yoga, sweat lodges for First Nations, where people can graduate drug-free, live in nearby housing that helps them wow. transition into a law-abiding drug-free life, come back to the center to get a counseling session, a workout, or maybe even to mentor an incoming addict on the hopeful future that is ahead. That is the way that we are going to bring our loved ones home drug-free. Yeah. As I always say, we are going to have a common sense dollar for dollar law requiring we find one dollar of savings for every new dollar of spending. And in this case, that will include how we will partly pay for this. We will unleash the biggest lawsuit in Canadian history against the corrupt pharmaceutical companies that profited off of this nightmare. We will make them pay. Here. Yeah. Here.